Um, this is an opportunity to explain to the good people of this country where we are. Samson, as of the 19th of February, that is um, the beginning of last week, Sunday, we had registered 17 million, and I've shared that slide um, with you. That will be slide number seven, if you are able to project it. Right. 17,375,861 Ghanaians. It is important to situate that in context. As of 21st February 2017, we had registered 4,554,528 Ghanaians. Fast forward to 19th February 2023, we have done 17.375 million. The total number of cards printed as at 20, uh, 2017 was 2,000, uh, sorry, 2,719,425. Two million seven hundred and nineteen thousand four hundred and twenty-five. By last week, uh, sorry, by last Sunday, we had printed a total of 16,737,734. As at February 2017, we had issued 900,000 cards, almost exclusively in the greater Accra region. <clears throat> Fast forward to 2023 February, we have issued, that is, we have handed over to 16,095,331 cards to Ghanaians. The card that we have issued to Ghanaians is top notch, is, is of the highest degree or caliber in the world. Mm. In 2017, we were issuing a 2D barcode card, pretty much like your old driver's license, with only four fingerprints and a two kilobyte storage capacity. Today, we are issuing smart dual interface biometric ID cards with 10 fingerprints and um, 148 storage capacity um, um, uh, card, a chip that is chip embedded. That is the kind of architecture um, we have built for this nation. Now, if you look at the statistics um, of registration, and I heard you mention um, um, Honorable Abuja from, I think at Dakulu you said, right. all those statistics that are being bandied around cannot be from the NIA database. And I do not know how some people purport to get their data. If you are looking for data, come to NIA and we will give it to you. And Samson, we gave our data to the parliament of this republic in June of last year upon their request. Yeah. We were there three days ago to give them. We were there yesterday to give them. As a result of some um, 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 misunderstanding over the absence of um, Mrs. Jean Mensa, chairperson of the Electoral Commission in the House, um, NIA could not be heard. And we've been um, invited back I presume on, on, on Tuesday. We will be there. We are a responsive, responsible public sector institution, efficient in what we do, committed to being the best. We focused, we are rigorous, and we are coherent. And those three catchwords drive us to provide future solutions now. Now, the data that we have, if anybody wants, we will give them. And then if there is any way of validating the data, we can explore that.